great city of Cincinnati. This is Nipper Stadium. And now it's time for the coin talk. And it's brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coca-Cola taste, zero calorie. Enjoy everything. Fletcher is on the field to kick this one off, and everyone in the stadium is ready for this game to get started. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. So let's see what the offense can do as they come out onto the field. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. From their own 30-yard line, second down. Complete, he's got room. Tackle around the 44-yard line. Not a real fancy play here, just a smartly run route. Good protection and a well-placed ball. Most times, you don't need much more than that. to set up a screen for the wide receiver. And he's tackled at the 40-yard line. Well, the defensive line has to do a better job there of feeling that screen out. And a lot, a lot of times the offensive line will dictate whether or not it is going to be a screen pass or not. And when they feel and sense the offensive lineman releasing out to get out in front of the screen and to be able to try to make a play downfield, again, the defensive line is the key for any defense and being able to slow down a screen pass. First and 10, ball on the 40. Looks for his running back, incomplete. These guys, especially in the secondary, really get after it and can make life hard for the play callers on the other side of the ball. Here we go. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. And that run got stuck. Yeah, you're right. The defense definitely won the battle with the line of scrimmage there. Third down now, and they need to get it down to the 30. He's out of bounds, right around the 38-yard line. Central Florida could take the lead with this field goal. Kicks away, and the kicking team goes to the sideline very disappointed. And this one's scoreless. The quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game. He's tackled right around the 36-yard line. The defensive coordinator has a lot of confidence in his pass defense, and he's releasing a safety to stop the run. It's second down, 12 to go. Ball on the 36-yard line. He's at midfield. They'll bring him down at about the 45. Did you see how much space there was for that tailback up front? He better be thanking his offensive lineman for that. Gives it off. Gets to about the 44-yard line. The halfback picks up a yard. And the ball carrier wasn't getting away from that tackle. From the 44-yard line, second down. Nice run up the middle. Setting up 
blockers or running backs got it on the screen. And they make the stop at the 37. The man defense proves to be too tough against the screen. That was an excellent job by the defenders. They fought off their blocks and found the ball before the play had a chance to develop. Defense stacked in tight here. He'll get it again. First down, pick up by the tailback. You can see how comfortable this guy is with that football in his arms. It's first and 10. Ball in 34. Again, he'll get the call. Nice run, and he's brought down. And this play is number eight on the drive. Here's the handoff, and he's taken down for a loss. Third down, and they need to get it to the 24. Looking for his man, incomplete. The deflection prevented them from getting any yards, and now it's fourth down. Cincinnati is looking to go up by three. It has the distance, and it's good! Looks like they're ready for the kick. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Cincinnati's in the driver's seat right now, but it's still early, Kirk. Yep, very early in this game, but you got to love the feel for it as far as they're concerned. They came up with a stop, and then they get points, and right now they're out of the game. You never like to have to play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. He's to the 40. Across midfield. Inside the 30. And they push him out around the 12-yard line. That makes it first and 10. First down and 10 to go after the big gain on the run. He's scrambling. Quarterback's going to run it, and he's got room to work. Brought down in the open field. Brought down at the nine. Third down, seven yards to go. Ball on the nine-yard line. And he's taken down at the two. Well, on third down, we expected them to go to the air, and they did just that, picking up the first down. It's a great tackle at the one-yard line. It's second and goal. About a yard to Pater. Throws quick to the receiver, and it falls incomplete. He 
splits the uprights with the extra point. So a seven play, 74 yard drive, and they get it in for seven. So the score now, 7-3. Central Florida is lining up to kick this one off. Excellent kick. He's to the 20. Brought down at the 28-yard line. And while they are behind, they know they can knock things up in a heartbeat. It's way too early to change your game plan. And he tackles him hard at the 20-yard line. Defense looking for another sack in the second down and long situation. Gives it left side. And down he goes around the 43 yard line. From their own 43 yard line. First down. Here's the run right. He's got nowhere to go. Loss of three yards on the way. Taken down at about the 49. It's third down, and they're about two yards shy of the sticks. And they get nice yardage on that run. It's another carry. Tackle made at the 35-yard line. It's second down now. They're just a few feet away from that first down marker. They bring him down in the backfield. That is just a great play getting into the backfield. This guy is so quick that the ball carrier never had a chance. Here's the eighth play of the series. Steps up. Tackle at about the 35. Looks like they've decided to go for it here. And he makes it out to about the 34-yard line. Tenth play of the drive. Up the middle for a nice game. From the 29-yard line, it's second down. He's hit and taken down. Here's the 12th play of the drive. Montgomery takes it left. He gets out to about the 18-yard line. No gain on the play. That makes it second and ten. Tight, 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 
Second down, 10 to go. Ball on the 18-yard line. Taken down in the backfield. Those linebackers do a great job of stopping the run, but they need to be careful to play action pass. You can easily get fooled and give up some big yards through the air. This game's already shaping up to be a good one as we head to the second quarter. 7-3, Knights. Welcome back. Tight game here in the second quarter as we begin play. He scrambled, and he is drilled at the 23. Fourth down. They'll line it up for the field goal. It's up. And it's through the uprights. Fletcher has the ball all teed up, and he's ready to kick this one off. He sends this one deep. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. There hasn't been too much daylight between these two teams. In games like this, some players try to press too much, and that can cause mistakes. Central Florida is up one. And he has it on the corner. He gets hit out of bounds at the 30. From their own 30-yard line. Second down. They'll spread the field here. Let's see what the defense does with a five-wide outlook. Gets it out to the wide out, and he's got the first. Superb effort by the receiver to come down with that ball. Uh, this comes down to the timing between the quarterback and the receiver, and the result, again, a nice play for the offense. Here we go. He gets out to about the 42-yard line. From their own 42-yard line, second down. He's at midfield. He gets out to about the 44-yard line. That makes it first and ten. This guy has that innate ability to get just enough distance from a defender to make a completion possible. You don't see it from every receiver, but this guy's got it. From the 33-yard line, it's first down. And he's tackled at the 30-yard line. run up the middle it's third down and this offense is about three feet away from that first down marker central florida up a point quick out to his receiver hey it's a, it's a first down for this offense that keeps everybody enthusiastic you can see the momentum that this offense is gaining the coaches and the players on the sideline are fired up and hey it's a new set of downs this is the ninth play of this drive. Runs right for a nice game. That's good for a game. That makes it second and six. It's second down, six yards to go. Ball on the 13.
He's tackled around the 17-yard line. That's not what you hope for from your running game. You're looking for some solid north and south progress. You never want to give the defense a play like that to build their confidence. It's the 11th play of the drive. Throws complete, and he's hit right away. It's fourth down. They'll line up for the field goal, and this is nothing more than a chip shot. Kicks away, and they tack on three points. Even though they gave up a field goal here, that defense is feeling pretty good about themselves right now. It could have just as easily been a touchdown. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He's to the 20. And he makes it out to about the 21-yard line. You know, this offense is doing a pretty good job moving the football. The problem is they're not coming up with touchdowns. The offense coordinator who's been up here next to us, Brad, in the booth next to us, he's actually just taken off his headsets, and I think he's going down to the field to be next to the quarterback and the rest of this offense to try to engage with them to realize how important it is to finish these drives. They'll bring him down at the 27-yard line. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. it out to about the 36. The option's one of the more difficult plays to defend. The defense went after the quarterback, which left the running back with plenty of room. He's on the run. He's at midfield. He's at the 40. And they make the stop around the 33-yard line. Let's see now how the defense responds to giving up the gain on the run. Trying to get it to the tight end, but it falls to the ground. Wow, Brad, you talk about having a strong arm. Next time, though, he might want to work on the accuracy. Catches it and hit immediately for a loss. That's a loss of about five. This defense is fast enough that they can create negative yards on completed passes. So the offense might want to consider that next time they try that play. Third down, and they need to get it to the 23. Pass complete and taken down immediately. The kick is up. It's got the distance. And he got it. Fletcher looks ready to kick this one off. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Central Florida with a one-point lead. He's in trouble. Brought down at the 33-yard line. So it's second down and about two yards to go. He gets to about the 41-yard line. They go with the option and pick up the first down. Yeah, and that was a situation where the quarterback knew he could pick up the first down if he kept it himself. That's a good decision. Yeah. 
and he makes it out to about the 41-yard line. Man, did he play that perfectly or what? As a linebacker, you have to be able to read the offense and make a quick diagnosis, which is exactly what he did on that play. Second down and 11 yards to the sticks. Ball on the 41-yard line. Nice run there. Solid five-yard pickup there on the halfback option. Empty backfield, quarterback in the gun. Five wide receivers. He's going to go for the home run. And he's taken down at the 13-yard line. Now it's first and ten with a defense trying to regroup after giving up the big pass. Fakes to the back. He's wrapped up for the sack. It's second down and 11 to go. Ball on the 13-yard line. Central Florida is up one. Throws it out, and it falls incomplete. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Complete, brought down, nothing doing. So it's fourth down. They're going to go for the easy three here. Kicks up, and it sails through the uprights. They line up to kick this one away. He really got a hold of that kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Now he's scrambling. And down he goes, right around the 36-yard line. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 36-yard line. Tries to scramble, but he's sacked. Sometimes it's just a relentless pass rush that results in a sack. That's what happened there. He's scrambling. He's taken down around the 38-yard line. From their own 38-yard line. Third down. Under heavy pressure. And they're going to get somebody for interference on that play. Let's see who the call is on. Pass interference. Offense. And they're going to have to bring on the punt team. On third down, the defense was expecting the pass. And they defended the play very well in the secondary. Richardson is back awaiting the punt. Booming kick. Tries to get around the corner. He makes it out to maybe the 29-yard line. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Central Florida holds a four-point lead. Setting up blockers, a running back's got it on the screen. Steps out of bounds at the 35. 
gain of six on the play. That'll make it second and four. So it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. He lets it fly. And he got it! Tackle right around the 24-yard line. Great play for the offense and a great call by the offense. But the defense has to change things up. They've got to put more pressure on this quarterback. So an empty backfield with five wide receivers. Throws it in a hurry. And they push him out at the 20. That makes it second and six. From the 20-yard line, it's second down. Got a man, watch out here. And he's level at the 12-yard line. The Knights are going to call their second timeout. They come out on an empty backfield. Touchdown, Knights. converts the extra point. Looks like they're ready for the kick. Excellent kick. Brought down at the 21. Their last drive resulted in a punt, so let's see if they can put together something a little more promising here. Nice play across the middle, and he's hit immediately. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. We played a half of football. UCF in front, 20 to 9. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. This is Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. There is nothing, and I mean nothing, that is more important than turnovers. Now, so far, neither defense has been able to force one in this game, but you never know when that opportunity is going to come up. No, and people look at turnovers and they assume that it's luck a lot of times, but a lot of times it's preparation. It's being able to know that when certain teams line up like South Carolina back in 2002 in a certain formation where it's Tucson, Oakland, Stud, and they got three receivers to my side, and I know it's a rollout pass. As a defensive end, I widened my stance a little bit, came up field, hit the quarterback as he was throwing it. Next thing you know, the ref signals his hands up in the air, and you get six points for it. So you can definitely be prepared, and that's how you force those turnovers. We've done what we can do here at halftime. Time to get you back out to the second half. We'll keep an eye on everything going on in college football. Brad Nessler and Kirk Herbstreit ready with a call. All right, Reese and David, thanks, guys. Second half action just about ready to start here. Sends it sailing downfield. He's to the 20, makes it to the 22-yard line. The Knights continue to get it done on the defensive side of the football, Kirk. Yeah, they've done a good job of building this lead and almost determined here to protect it. Let's see if they can hold on here for the rest of the way. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. He makes it to the 25-yard line. Call it a gain of three yards. That makes it second and eight. From their own 25-yard line, second down. 
Tackle made right around the 28-yard line. Zipped it out, and that was almost picked off. Fletcher is waiting for the snap. And this one is a beauty. He's to the 40. And he makes it out to about the 47-yard line. It's going to be interesting to see how the action shakes out in this series. He scrambled, decides to tuck it in, and he's got space. And he's tackled at about the 37-yard line. It's first and 10, ball on the 37-yard line. And he makes it out to about the 37-yard line. And they get nice yardage on that run. They need about three yards to get the first down here on third down. Comes away with two yards on the carry. He might have a chance. He's tackled at the 13. That makes it first and 10. From the 13 yard line. First down. These guys need to be aware this aerial attack is capable of making some big plays. They've got to get on their toes. Splits the uprights with the extra point. Central Florida gets set to kick this one away. He'll take it from the two. He makes it out maybe to the 26-yard line. The defense did a nice job shutting down the offense the last time they had the ball. If they're going to make a comeback in this game, it's going to have to start now. This offense has to get rolling. Little handoff. Room around the corner. Gains his way to the 39-yard line. It's great when a running attack comes through for the first down like this. It makes an offense so much more versatile. From their own 39-yard line, it's first down. They make the stop at the 36. The quarterback tried to do a little too much by himself. Hey, maybe next time he'll get it out to the back so he can do something with it. They'll bring him down around the 37-yard line. We've got third and 12. Ball on the 37. 
under heavy pressure. And they got it. Boy, Brad, that was a big hit on the quarterback. I'm going to be interested to see how he responds from this hit and whether or not he comes after his offensive linemen and challenges them to start playing a little bit better. The sack makes this a fourth and very long. Richardson awaiting the return. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. Fielded at the 19. They'll bring him down at the 25-yard line. So it's time to see this offense go to work again. This defense couldn't stop them from moving the ball and inevitably finding the end zone. He's going to try and scramble. So the quarterback scrambles for about four yards on the play. From their own 29-yard line, second down. Brought down at about the 35. Handoff to the right. And the short gain is enough for the first. And that tailback definitely has a nose for that first down marker. From their own 37 yard line. First down. pick and he dropped it. You don't want to ever give your opponent a second chance, but that's exactly what they did by not making that interception. Makes it to the 47. If you can consistently run effectively like this, it'll force the defense to pay more attention to the run, and that creates chances in the play-action passing game. First and 10, ball on their own 47. Throws out and through his hands. Fires out quickly to the tailback. How about that play? That's a good pickup there. He just dropped back and delivered a nice throw. This is the eighth play of this drive. Strike to his receiver, no good. This is a well-designed play by the offensive coordinator. Everything really seemed to be working just fine, except for the quarterback. He's got to throw a better football. McCarthy is the punter. He really got a hold of that one. This one will go into the end zone, and they'll bring it out to the 20. They were forced to punt the ball away the last time they had it. They'll be looking for a little more out of their offense on this possession. Down two possessions. This offense has to step up and capitalize on this possession. Run left side. And he's taken down at the 32. First and 10, ball on the 32. He's gobbled up in the backfield. in the counter to the halfback.
from their own 32 yard line. Third down. Throws complete, and he's got space to work. At the 30. And down he goes at the 19. The offense caught him flat-footed to convert that third and long. You can tell by the coach's reaction that that is a huge disappointment. So let's see how the defense responds now. It's first down and 10. And he's hit before he can go anywhere. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. We've got second and goal. Five yards to the goal line. He's taken down around the seven yard line. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Fires incomplete. It's fourth down. This should be an easy field goal. Kicks up, and he got it. Cincinnati to kick. He really got a hold of that kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Their last drive broke down, and they punted. What do they have in store this time out? Wants to throw outside. From their own 25-yard line. Second down. He's scrambling. He picks up a good seven yards there, the quarterback keeper. Run up the middle. Call it a gain of six yards. That makes it first and ten. From their own 38 yard line. First down. We give the defense all the credit here. They had that one snuffed out from the start. It could have been an even bigger loss. He's on the run. Quarterback's going to run it, and he's got room to work. Tackle at the 45-yard line. Third down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. He gets out to about the 48-yard line. It's not over yet, folks. We head to the fourth quarter. 
the Knights in front by 15. Back in this very pivotal fourth quarter. Helton back to return it. Got the corner. And down he goes at the 31. They're ready to begin another drive. Strike to the receiver. Tackle made at the 44-yard line. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 44. He gets it out to about the 47-yard line. on the play. It's third and five. Ball on the 49. Get to that quickly. That's a great tackle at the 43. the catch and he's got nowhere to go. Second and nine. Ball on the 42. Off play action. Now he's on the move. Jones gains about five yards on the scramble out of the pocket. Scrambling, and they bring him down for a sack on the play. It's fourth down, and the offense is getting set to go for it. He throws right, and he's hit immediately. First down, and they've got their eyes on that goal line. He's tackled at about the three-yard line. This is the tenth play of this drive. They're crowding the line. And they'll bring him down behind the line. The defense has really held their own the last two plays. Now it's third and goal from the seven. Yeah. 
Throws out to the tight end again, completes. He's tackled at the five-yard line. Only three yards there on the throw. Usually you get a linebacker covering the tight end, so they might want to try some longer passes to exploit that mismatch. Scrambling around. Got a man open. Touchdown. And a nice catch by the receiver for the touchdown. Anytime you're near the red zone, you got to keep an eye for this guy. They love going to him down here. You know, if a quarterback has a strong arm, one of his favorite routes is the post. But I thought the quarterback did a really good job here of using his eyes to move the safety, to open up that void in the defense, and then he made the good throw to the receiver for the touchdown. And they won't get the two. So a 12-play, 69-yard drive. But the failed two-point conversion keeps it a six-point score. You know, Brad, a lot of times you have to watch practice and watch a seven-on-seven -seven drill to not see the ball touch the ground. This time, they went the entire length of the field. The ball never touched the ground. Great execution by the quarterback and the receiver. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. He's going left. From their own 25-yard line, second down. Zips it to the tight end. And they make the stop around the 40-yard line. First down. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 40-yard line. Some him open field. Gets out to around the 48. That makes it first and 10. And he hits him hard at the 47. Second and ten. Ball on the 47-yard line. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. That's a game seven. That'll bring up 32. He scrambled, slides down to the ground. What is going on with his defense? I mean, don't get me wrong, the offense is doing a nice job with first downs and they're executing well, but the defense is just letting them maintain possession and move the ball right down the field. They've got to try to change things up with their scheme. Be more aggressive, attack, do some things to change it up, take some risks. And he's level at the 23. And this play is number eight on the drive. Go into the end zone. Can't hang on. Incomplete. It's third down, and this offense is about three feet away from that first down marker. And he's tackled after positive yardage. Call it a gain of seven yards. Here's play number 10 on the drive. Halfback's got it on the quick throw. That's good for a gain of eight yards. That makes it so it's second down and about two yards to go.
wise receiver, touchdown. Don't get too excited at home, folks, because I think this one is coming back. Here it is. You gotta be careful to avoid these. Penalties are a great way to stall out a drive. They've looked good so far on third down in this drive. Let's see what happens here. Less than three minutes in the game. left finding his tailback they'll bring him down right around the 14 yard line they get a one yard loss on that one pretty good stand there they weren't fooled at all by the offensive play call it's fourth down they'll line it up for the field goal it's up and it sails through the uprights central florida ready to kick this one off he kicks it off and he got all of that one this one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Well, I'm sure the return man would have loved to go for six that time. Well, at this point in the game, this offense has no choice. They've got to try to get down the field as quickly as possible and come up with a touchdown, probably an onside kick or a quick defensive stop, get the ball back and get another touchdown. So they need to execute and execute as well as they can. That makes it second and eight. Quick throw out to the receiver. Right down at the 43-yard line. Not a real fancy play here, just a smartly run route. Good protection and a well-placed ball. Most times, you don't need much more than that. Pulls down the catch, and he's got room here. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. out quickly to the tailback. He's knocked out of bounds around the 45-yard line. Just under two to go in the game. He's in trouble. Quick pass tight end, and he wasn't ready for it. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 45-yard line. Slings it. And he's taken down at the 33-yard line. Dumps it complete, the tight end over the middle. And down he goes around the 29-yard line. it out in a hurry almost picked off that was a nice play anything you can do without being penalized to prevent the offense from moving forward is always a plus so we're looking at another third down here quick pass he's taken down at the 21 Cincinnati's gonna have to use their second time out of the hat this is the 11th play of this drive From the 21 yard line. Second down. Nice catch, first down, and he's knocked out. Play 13 of the current drive. Under a minute left. He is drilled at the 10-yard line. 
makes it second and ten. The spike will stop the clock. They line up for another third down, and they've had no problem converting their first two. Fires quick. He catches another. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. That brings us fourth and so a big, big stop on fourth down here late in the fourth quarter. So now both teams come trotting back out onto the field. Safety. Don't wait. They're going to say he's down at the one. But well, you can really mess with an offense's game plan if you can take away their ability to run. He's to the 10. And he tackles him hard at the 14. And this one's all but wrapped up with the final score, Central Florida, 30, Cincinnati, 18. Thanks for joining us for another game of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk and everyone here at EA Sports, Brad Nussler saying goodbye, and we'll see you next time.